Kim Hiora, who most recently appeared in Uncanny Counter 2 and The Glory, was previously a school bully and a violent offender. According to Dispatch, in an exclusive piece, Dispatch went into detail about Kim Hiora's history of bullying and violence at schools when she was a middle schooler. She was being bullied when she was a student at Sangji Girls Middle School in Gangwon Province's Wonju area. During class, student X raised their hand and signaled a need to use the loo. Actually, that was just a pretext, and the student moved on to a vacant classroom. Due to the fact that the students were absent for PE class, the classroom was empty. Additionally, the pupil stole things from that class. The eighth grade pupil who admitted to taking belongings from others was, but she gave a defense for her actions. In response to this admission from student A, Kim Hiora, who was then in the ninth grade, was also invited into the office for interrogation. She said she was not involved. However, Dispatch has revealed that Kim Hiora was a member of the notorious Big Sangji bullying gang at Sangji Girls Middle School. Big Sangji had a history of verbal and physical abuse, extortion, and attack of other students. In May 2023, Dispatch learned of Kim Hiora's alleged involvement in acts of school violence. The source claimed they never anticipated seeing a Big Sangji bully curse on television. Between May and June, Dispatch visited with 10 former Sangji girls high school students. Additionally, Kim Hiora's personal statement concerning the incident was obtained by Dispatch. The full situation report from Dispatch is provided below. At Sangji Girls High School, the bullies are known as Big Sangji. Extortion was the major means of bullying they used. They would spend the money they received from others on their own amusement. Undoubtedly, Kim Hiora was a member of Big Sangji. She even contributed to the discussion board for the organization. She was able to provide screenshots of her messages to dispatch. Although Kim Hiora herself confirmed being a member of Big Sangji, she disputed several of the informant's assertions. In response to Kim Hiora's assertion, another former student, C, asserted that while anyone could apply to join, not everyone would actually be let into their group. Kim Hiora addressed these allegations as well. The first semester of 2004 was in session. Student X, who was involved in the theft of personal items, was in 8th grade, whereas Kim Hiora was in 9th grade. The family was insolvent at the time, due to the father of Kim Hiora's employees failing to make a profit. She put a lot of effort into trying to make some extra cash while working at a Korean fast food restaurant. Two students, X and Y, were informed of this circumstance by Kim Hiora. Within Sangji Girls Middle School, X and Y were well known, and their friendship was crucial to the heist. Regarding the stolen event, Dispatch was able to speak with X. Additionally, X admitted in their letter of reflection and repentance that they had committed theft to support Kim Hiora financially. Kim Hiora and X both received punishments from the teacher since she didn't believe her. Her current remark directly contradicts what she said following the incident 20 years ago. Kim Hiora could recall the situation with clarity and told dispatch what had taken place. Community work was assigned to X and Kim Hiora as punishment. They were separated for two weeks so they could think things over. Kim Hiora was motivated to work on herself after this. She focused on her studies during the second semester of ninth grade in order to pursue a humanities degree in high school. While X relocated to a new neighborhood, regarding Kim Hiora, one source alleged that she forced her to buy cigarettes. Kim Hiora allegedly demanded money from another informant so they could go to karaoke. The assertions made by Kim Hiora, however, disagree. Several big Sangji members who remained in touch after Kim Hiora's involvement in the glory discussed Kim Hiora's portrayal in the program. So guys, what are your thoughts on Kim Hiora's bullying scandal? Let us know what you think in the comments down below. So guys, that's all for today. I hope you enjoyed this video. Do give a thumbs up to this video and subscribe to the channel with the bell button on because this would really make me motivated to make new videos for you. You might love these two videos, so check them out right now.